After interviewing Ryan Kelly's high school basketball coach, Kevin Villerman, last week, Nevermore Online thought it would be interesting to interview Ryan's parents. This week, we had the unique opportunity of interviewing both Ryan's mother and father. Yeses, and how you, how you know, how would anybody's mom react in that moment? Um, I remember before the game, standing next to my own mom, um, feeling very emotional, watching layup lines because he hadn't come out in the first warm up so it made me wonder if he was really going to play, but then he came out through the warm ups and so I felt very emotional watching the warm ups because I thought, wow, what a miracle that he gets to be back out there. Just I was happy with warm ups. And I remember saying to my mom, you know, it'd just be really cool if he could play a few minutes. Like and just kinda get back into and just the reception for the White Raven going like this <laughs> totally was kind of really fascinating. So um, beyond that, I didn't have a bigger expectation for him, so the rest of the night um, was a lot of jumping up and down and, and a very joyful time. Somewhere probably around halftime, I started getting excited, hoping he could keep up that tremendous run that he had going. When I coached him as, as a kid, I really focused more on shooting and ball handling with him rather than being a post player. And so I think coaches saw that, and so they realized, well, there's a big kid that can kind of do something. Five minutes to go, all I was worried about is winning the game because it really isn't that important to have a great game if you lose. Ryan's an interesting case because if people knew him as a freshman and a sophomore in high school, he was six seven, really, really skinny. And at that point, he was being recruited by, you know, small D1s, which was great. I mean, I thought maybe you'd go to the Ivy League or, you know, something like that. And then junior year, somewhere in there, somewhere in there he grew and got to be about six nine, but he was still really skinny. And um, so I just figured he'd end up at a, you know, a good school, a good academic school, play good basketball. So I give him credit. He was worked, you know, he worked really hard in high school. He's continued to work really hard in college. And you got to give the coaching staff at Duke credit. Obviously, his high school coach, Mr. Billerman, and um, and he's really just gotten better and better and better. So are you the one who takes credit for his awesome jump shot? Uh, well, I taught him when he was young. I, I, he went to my camps for years. I used to run basketball camps. and So I did teach him. But there have been a lot of people that have, have been a part of that. Look, Coach Billerman just walked in, and he's a part of that. Although, I don't know about the jump shot part. So you can <laughs> For Nevermore Online, I'm Jordan Bedmore. Stay tuned.